Hello everybody, welcome back to another session by K21 Academy. Today our expert trainer will be discussing about AWS Virtual Private Cloud. Specifically, we'll be talking about default and non-default VPC. So let's get into the video. So what is the difference between the default VPC and the non-default VPC? So default VPC you always have seen by default, which is created. Non-default VPC is actually the custom VPC that you will now in future you will be creating into your account. That is known as your non-default VPC. By default, there is a VPC which is created in every account, which is known as default VPC. You can create your own VPC, which is custom VPC, which is non-default. When you are creating the EC2 instance, by default, the default VPC gets selected. But if you want, you can choose your own custom VPC while you are launching the instance. All advanced features that are provided in the default VPC can be configured on your custom VPC also. So there is no such and difference between the default VPC and the custom VPC. So the only thing is that the non default VPC is the VPC that you create and the default VPC is the VPC which is pre-created by Amazon. In default VPC, all the resources are pre-created. In the default VPC, if you click on this, you see that a default VPC is created and there is a DHCP option set which is there. There is a routing table which is associated with it. So if you click on the routing tables, 41C at the end. See, this is created over here. The subnets are pre created. The IPs are pre assigned. There is an internet interface has been created. See, internet gateway, which is attached to whom? To default VPC. So everything is created over here. There is a DHCP option set which is created for you. If you click on that, you'll be able to see that this is the DHCP option set that is created. This is actually for automatic IP address assignment to, to your machines. So guys, this was our expert from Team K21 Academy. And if in case you missed upon any concept or if you want to dive deeper into the concepts, then we have something really special for you. We have our free class on Amazon AWS Solution Architect Certification for Beginners. Under this free class, you'll be learning about why and who should learn AWS, cloud services, deployment models, and AWS services as well. And the most important part is you'll be getting hands-on labs, job opportunities, along with Docker and Kubernetes in AWS, and amazing, amazing stuff. So if you want to register for this free class, all you have to do is just log on to your browser and type k21academy.com forward slash AWS SA02. And after that, you'll be seeing this kind of interface. You just have to click on book your free seat now, select your event date, add your name, your email address, your phone number, and click on yes, save my seat. And after that, you'll be seeing this kind of page. You just have to save this link on the extreme right, add it to your calendars, and I'll see you in the free class. Till then, keep learning.